Hey there, everyone. This is Alcalbling Banjo 2, and as we can see, Witchy World, the fully completed. However, we will be returning again. Just not right now. All right, yeah. So today I've got. Uh, I should have looked there. I, I just didn't really think. You know, this is just a, just a real nice, clean way to cut things. But if I look at my objects. Yeah, I'm one hexagon away from being able to claim a health, sadly, but I can claim a cheat. So we're gonna do that. Uh, and then we're going to input that cheat. Wow, I know why. Pretty wild. Then we're gonna do some cross... not crossword. Some jigsaw puzzles. Those are not the same. Then there's like one thing to check on the map that I remember that... Uh, I don't know if you remember how there was... Um, uh, 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 sticky shoes over the temple entrance. So we'll look into that. And then afterwards, I don't know. Like, we'll see how much time there is. This might just, I might just decide to make this a shorter episode. Nothing wrong with that, I don't think. Uh, otherwise, I, uh, wait a second. I'm just kind of curious about something. We. View total here. Oh, I do have all the notes here. There's one Jinjo somewhere. I don't know where immediately. We haven't seen absolutely- Oh, you know what? There was also some sticky pads in the wasteland. We might want to check there real quick. Maybe like a Jinjo's there or something. I'd be willing to check. Yeah, today is like... Odds and ends. <laughs> kind of awkward. Not a celebratory uh, of an episode, but that's okay. Those are necessary. Well, if it ain't our pal Cheeto, give me your code. Great! Uh, that's right. So I got the extra eggs and I got the extra feathers. Uh, I don't know what's gonna be next. Ten order my precious pages first. It's gonna be extra health. Homing wasn't from you. My third cheat is fallproof! Oh, that is something I can use. I feel like most of my health loss has been due to falling from great heights, so, uh... Fallproof new? No, yeah. No, I, I needed that. Thanks, man. Oh yeah, you get like a scroll here, because there's just too many options. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Is it? I, I think it is. I mean, it's like not laughing funny, it's just something funny. Yeah, so there's steppies. Right? There are steppies right here. So where are the shoes that enables the steppies? Those are eggs and an evil hive. Is it along this, like, pipe thing? Where can I find steppy shoes? Yeah, 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 exactly. Alright, cool. Nope, no, nope, not. Alright, you know what? Uh, 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 but deeper. Alright, here we go. I'm not expecting much. Yeah, that's right, run towards the camera. I mean, it's fine if you run towards the camera, if the road is obvious. I have no problem against that. There's a pipe there. It's maybe a way out from Steppiesville. I guess we're gonna find out. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, we end up like right here. You know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and close it. I don't need them no more. Ah. Okay, and here we're gonna put a button so that we can use this pipe in the future. See, I was hoping the Jinjo I'm missing on the overworld would be here, but I guess that's not the case. So, a ninth altar for a cauldron keep. For which I would need 10. Now, obviously, this would require dipping into more work than I am willing. So we are going to keep that for after the other two levels. We've got a laser door in a way. Whoa, that is a sound effect combination that is very pleasant to the ears. Oh, maybe the Jinjo is where the steppies are in the other map. And that would complete everything on the map, I think. I'm not a fan of calling these steppies, but like, I, I need a word that is simple. And yeah, they're like right there. They're like right in front of your eyeballs when you appear here. And I think it's on the roof of this thing? 
Look at that, it's a snowflake and a fireball, and they're kind of not really placed well together. They're just kind of put there. <laughs> Look, ancient whoever's did not have formal training in graphic design, all right? You haven't, oh, I knew that was gonna happen. This is my weakness, like right there, weird corner, I can't change the camera, I'm not sure where I am in space. That is scientifically crafted to be something very simple that gives me a disproportionate amount of problems. Scientific. Imagine doing that to a dragon. See, the thing is, I don't know how long they go. Alright, let's try this again. I'm gonna take my time a bit more here. I, like, to my, my eyes, like, I could tell I was at a different place, but I look just as aligned with the thing than the other. So, oh yeah, there's Dunjo. Hey, it's back, Dunjo. And you get this to get out. So, this completes everything here for Isla Hag. Unless there are other collectible types and they just do not appear because I haven't found them. But considering the breadth of exploration and stuff I've done, I think this is it for here. Other than the Jinjo families, of course. Like, that's what the Jiggies are. And, you know, I got a lot of, gin of the Jiggies and I could make that away. But I'm just, I'm just not collecting them. What can I say? Uh, fall proof, right. Fall proof. You know? The the lottery machine, the roulette machines in Witch World uh, are basically those same things as the stone statues, except they aim better. If you really think about it. All right, F A. There we go. Double L. Proof. All right, so P R. Double O. And then you retype the F. So it's a little bit treacherous, like you can't just look at all the letters and see what you spell because it doesn't realize when you, uh, you're you like double tapping things when you use the letters several times. That just sits weird to me. Like I understand why you shouldn't care, but like they, 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 they lit up, so like that should be meaningful. <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> I guess it's just, yeah, I mean you get the little drink to tell you that you hit it. I don't know. I'm being weird about this. It's weird little brain worms about... It bothers me. I think that every code should not have reused any le letters so that it would look good. I mean, look, for the super secret codes, whatever, repeat letters all you want. But for the normal ones where the letters lit up, I don't know, man. I don't know. All right, Jiggy Wiggy. We got two crosswords to do, and we're going to do them. <laughs> wow, what a concept. <laughs> Sometimes we say things. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so this is gonna be for what I've been calling the temple world all this time. Uh, we have seen it, you know, a little bit on the map here and there. Uh, and here we can appreciate the fact that while we were looking at windows of this place it was all like nice and shivery Here it's showing a sweet little like fiery lava filled temple. It's pretty wild Make your own conclusions but for now. I mean, yeah, you can have like a hot little place uh, In a cold place, you know, it's it's hail as in hail, but then there's fire in the name, too. So you, you, you gotta correspond to both, you know, there's like, there's an icicle and there's a little flame. You know, they love to spend times at a picnic together eating stale Doritos. I don't know why it bombed there. Hey, I, can, I found the hexagon. Just gonna reach in and grab it. You can't do that though. Now the great one will show you the way. I wonder what's going to happen. Laser beam's gonna open up a door probably, but hey, you don't know. There might be a surprise. There might be. It's possible that there could be a surprise. But I don't know. 
All right, here we go. Big beam. Particle effects. Everyone is amazed. And then, scene cut. You gotta load the place. Yeah, it's the Isle of Hag at the cliff top. Got a little Pteranodon there hovering, doing his best. Uh, hey, check it out. It's this place. I think it'd be cool if the beam would have opened up the bridge, but no. Instead, it's a button. Oh, why you, you just blow open the door? Okay. There's no opening that thing. Just shatter it into pieces. Stone, more like n n none. It does, it does not rhyme. It ends the same way. Yeah, that's right. I'm going to do that. Something about Cloud World. So let's check out what that looks like. Yeah, pan out. Hand back in. Here we go. We are ready. Look at that. See, it's a, it's a cave. It's a, it's a cave in the. Oh, all right. This is not a piece I should be trying to place. Okay, it it went there. By the way, this is like a whole lot of white. It's kind of the worst puzzle. I mean, sometimes it shifts into blues and stuff. So you know, that's that's exciting. It's still not a whole lot to go out on. Go. All right, corner piece. You know, oh, we got steppies. You're gonna go here. There's a safe. I just noticed. All right, you're like around here. Yeah, there you go. You're gonna be like here. Yeah, you are in the corner. Amazing. We're ending this side. There you go. You're gonna be on top. Like all the leftover pieces. There's basically only one place they can go. Oh, I'm gonna reach out and get those notes. There's gonna be notes and split paths in World 8. Wow! So now the Great One will show you the way. Then Banjo gives himself a thumbs up. I guess he gives it to me. He's aware he's being controlled. I don't know. Like, that's kind of the funny thing. They're aware they're in a video game sometimes by the text. But, like, do they still think they're all NPCs? Like, does Banjo is aware that he's not in full control of himself? Nor is Kazooie. Maybe that's why they can be rude in text. Because it's like, well, they gotta assert some kind of control over themselves. This is gonna be through rudeness. It's not a way to live, man. So in this fissure over here that we've seen some time ago... This little purple pit gets blasted by a beam and the destruction causes a little bubble. So there you go. Little bubble is now ours to admire. Alright, I do not have enough, I know, for the laser grid up on the wasteland. Alright, so what does this mean? Honestly, I think we're gonna have just a very tiny episode because looking at session lengths and stuff I like I feel like I just step into world 7 and then I'm like all right Well, I killed like one enemy or something. I don't know and you guys know how much well wow, that guy's just hovering I guess he can't go over the little portal um, You guys know that I like my things nice and cleanly cut right? so I'm going to nicely Cut this cleanly right here and next time we're crossing that bridge once more but we're gonna go into that temple and something's going to something Ooh, who filled up all my stuff maybe Cheeto cuz yeah look at that now it feels nice to see all those numbers like all bright and full Why? why is my note number weird though I mean I probably didn't get all the notes somewhere like that's that's what that means typically 